Why are you crying? Smile. Aren't you happy? Life held me back. But death has set me free. Whether it be tonight or ten years from now. Dancing with you will always be the same. Because time stands still for the dead. If I am to protect... You should rest now. And... Hey, it's the Aether I've always wanted. Okay. Before we summon ML Politis, I think we should probably burn through these uh, galaxy bookmarks, right? Here's our counter up in the corner. Okay, everybody, wish me luck. Oh. oh, man. Is there any, uh... Is there any worse <laughs> ML4 in the game? I mean, they really have to do something for this guy, right? They abuse the hell out of him in the story. Uh, I'm missing my second Zeo. I would like a second Zeo. Ah, uh, bad cat Armin, man. Yeah, he got off-screened. In a brutal way. Who doesn't love Dorcas? Okay, enough with the blues. This girl needs a specialty change. I think she could be really fun to play if they just gave her a little bit of love. Her kit's fun. <sighs> There's a lot of blues. <laughs> Gloomy would be a lot of fun. Gloomy would also be kind of broken, right? She's the only mage in the game. Um, she's the only uh, mage in the game with a speed imprint. And there's a lot to unpack and what that means. Okay. Let's, let's cl cleanse the palette here. Nice. Nice cleansing of the palette. I don't think I have any use for this. I think both of my shoes are, I think both of them are triple S plus. Let's take a look though. That rat is triple S and that rat is triple S. Man, <laughs> Doris loves me this morning. <laughs> I mean, she's kind of an ML5, right? I mean, doesn't she kind of count? You had to speak that into existence, joke. I swear to God, if, if I get Inos. Mercy. Hey, who said Gloomy Rain earlier? There she is. I never noticed the little mouth in her hand. Alright, surely this is gonna spark, right? It's gonna crack into sparks. Or not. 
we're uh, up to three ML4s. Okay, how many blues in a row is this? It's only two because we had Kitty. We need to cleanse the palette again. Okay, here we go. Politus imprint. Show me fire Politus. That's a funny looking Politus. Okay, Lux reset. Now we get our ML5. I mean, now. Oh, so the, this is the guaranteed one, right? Ah, that's a four star. Mm. Oh, remember when I said, is there a worse four star than Furious? Mm. This was the most sought after four star, like in 2019, everybody wanted this unit. Like she was necessary if you wanted to cleave an arena. She was just about the fastest unit out there, high space speed, and she CR pushed your team. Everyone used this unit back in the day. Oh, that one cracked up. Uh <laughs> okay, wait. There's another contender for worst ML4 in the game. <laughs> and there she is. Just when you think your life's, life, your life's about to change, your luck's going to get better, Smilegate shows you their Inus. <laughs> yeah, baby, that's a good one. Hell yeah. All you doubters talking ML haste and all that. This is a pog one, man. I've gotten a lot of Flitticas, but she's not triple S yet. So that is wanted. Anybody else like Lorena's base model better than her uh, specialty change? With the, 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 the dorky single ponytail. <laughs> I just kind of like it better. Hey, it's reverse Inos. Polly is pretty. I thought she would be really good in um, Ancient Inheritance because she, she's got a lot in her kit. Uh, Built-in defense sprays. Not a lot of thieves that pack defense breaks like her and Assassin Sid, I think. <laughs> she's almost a redhead. <laughs> Last one. Let's go. Hey, new tasks. What exactly those tasks entail doesn't matter. Okay, guys, the gates are open. In in a hundred summons, we got an ML5, a, a, a uh, brand new three star unit, and five ML five ML4s. This is above average, and I'm about it. So let's strike while the iron is hot. Bring you Syria, Elbrus, I'll send you to the afterlife. And how many are we gonna get? I would really like like three or four of these before Polly pops out. Syria, I do have some imprints left on my uh, Assyrias, so I, I I wouldn't hate getting more of her either, but I would rather not burn my luck there. 
Nah, Lydica is not stealing anything. Lydica is the harbinger of good luck. Let's go. I'm telling you, Lydica is the harbinger of good luck. This was just practice. This was just getting ready for the luck. This means nothing. Don't read into this. Oh, oh! Let's go. There's nothing <laughs> just doing things as you're told. Oh, yeah, baby. <laughs> Let's go. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. Hey, I got two of the Ron Valders. Let's dive deeper into the good luck that Faithless Lydica is bringing us. Another practice round. We're okay with that. You gotta have those practice rounds. Sometimes you need two. Okay? Don't, uh... Don't read into this too much. This is just, you know, just setting the stage. It's not cope, it's, it's real, it's not cope. This is another pretty unit that we should, should really be more usable. I hate that they just tried to make her a Hua Young counter and then abandon her. A lot of run vaults. Okay, okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, yeah, baby. <laughs> Damn. Mm -mm -mm. So good. So good. Hey, hey, Rastafarius, good to see you. Yeah, they knew what they were doing. Can never have enough El 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 Elbrus Elbrusies. Elbrusises. El. Yes. You can never have enough of that artifact. Okay, we are halfway to pity. A lot of four star. Give me that powder. We got a collab coming up. Give me that powder. It's the Ricardo. Ew, okay. I think we've had enough practice runs. We can we can do away with this. I does anybody know of another one? Is Epic 7 the only game where 10 pulls don't guarantee a single four star? I thought that was kind of like a gotcha standard where if you did a 10 pull, one of them was guaranteed to be a four star. I mean, freaking even Star Rail does that. Is that too much to ask? I don't think that's too much to ask. Hmm. We're getting an L's fisting here. But we had to we had to seed the ground for the luck. Now we get the luck. Now we get the luck on the next pull, not this one. It's definitely the next pull. I can feel it coming, right? It's gonna happen. It's gonna happen on the next pull. On the next pull. Okay. Any minute now. Any minute now, Faithless Lydica is going to bring the luck, and it's going to be amazing. And that's not it. 35 from Pity. Let's go. Oh. 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 Yeah. 
Yuck. Yuck. One last ten pull. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, oh, oh. The hell off my screen, Zorado. Alrighty. We're down to a few singles to finish it off. Why do I look so happy? Because I got two Elbrus on the way down there, man. Oh, that's her voice line. Okay, guys. Two Elbrus, no fat cats, and we only, I mean, yeah, we went down to pity, but we started at what, like 130, I think? So it really wasn't that many mystics. I mean, I'm still sitting on half of my mystics. I'll be able to get that back up to 10k before the next one, so I am pretty pleased with how this went. If I, if it wasn't for those Elbrus, I'd been a little bit sad, but man, this was a good run. I'm happy that I got those Elbrus. This is my true strength. Oh! With just a single Mystic Summon, out she popped in one pull. Would you care to share a dance with me? Why, yes. Yes, I would like to share a dance. Why, yes, my lady. She is barefoot. Oh, that was lovely. We have any politics in storage. Oh, we have one. Sweet. The first imprint's the most important one. There she is. What are her awakenings? Is there any speed in her awakenings? <clears throat> Defense, health. Okay, there's four speed there. What could we do with this? Two ninety five. I mean, not that I'm gonna take Flitica's gear, but two ninety five is not bad, right? Where where are we wanting to run her? I think I think she's about. I think that's about right for this unit. I think that's a little nuts. I don't think she needs to be that fast. I don't think I want to give her my best of the best gear. I'll be honest with you. I'm, I'm as an aggro unit. I'm probably gonna run her a little bit slower. I think I can build this unit pretty good. Anyone, anyone, anything? How many pulls? Um, we started at 131, I think, and we went all the way down to pity, but we got two Elbrus on the way, and Fat Cat never reared his ugly head. So I'm pretty, pretty pleased. Which artifact am I planning to use for her? She's got a built-in... She's got a built-in guiding light, so she doesn't need that. If her S3 is not an attack, I guess you still get benefit on her S1, but for, for an aggro opener, you don't plan on having openers do anything other than open. So I think um, 
if that's the case, then we want Sashay on her, or um, if you've got an extra one, you want her to carry book, with, you know, a ranger book. Where is it? A yeah, ranger book. I'm not taking that off of her, though, but I think I've got another one of those laying around. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I can't... I don't have a third one, and that artifact is way more useful for me on Flan and on uh, Elena. What are you guys saying? Hear me out, Leica artifact. Oh, you, uh, Leica artifact is a neat idea, right? That uh, gives a big old barrier when using non-attack. What's that one? Uh, saw it here a minute ago. Glow wings. After using a non-attack skill, Barrier, 15% of max health. I mean, it's going to be a small barrier, but a barrier is a barrier, right? Yeah, this is nice utility, but... I guess the nice thing about this on an opener is it gives you a little bit of protection against clapbacks, right? You're, you're, if, you're, if you're going to run cleave or extremely aggressive aggro, every little bit of free tankiness helps because you probably aren't running like mitigation nights so much so this is interesting tech yeah glow wings unseen both of these are very useful i think unseen holds more value in an aggro pick but but this gives you an added layer of protection so both are good you know there's a world where you can do this too you can make two of your units stealth at the beginning she's stealth with her built-in Guiding Light, and she's going to give stealth to somebody else on the team after she takes a turn, and she's probably going to take a turn before anybody else. I think some people might cook with this. A lot of people were complaining that they put Guiding Light in her kit, but I kind of like it. I kind of like that they put Guiding Light in her kit because it lets you use other Ranger artifacts. I mean, we're looking at artifacts that nobody uses. Glow, glow Wings? Spatio-Temporal Fan? Who uses this crap? I mean, nobody, because... If it's a ranger, it uses guiding light. People ask me how many guiding lights should you have? I'm like, well, there's like 50 rangers in the game. So yeah, you you, you need a boatload of guiding lights because just about every ranger that is used uses guiding light. So it's really nice that a uh, a new new ranger comes out and doesn't require a limited artifact to work. So I'm pretty pleased with that. Just because. There's a whole sea of unused artifacts. I don't know, guys. I'm really, really torn on Sashe. The Glow Wings is nice. The Glow Wings is nice for a little bit of survivability. The uh, uh, Unseen Observer is nice for some souls. But if you're running aggro, you're killing crap fast. And with, with aggro, tempo is so important. And this is so much tempo. It's not just when she kills things. Anybody kills something, her artifact's gonna proc. She doesn't even have to be the one that does it. She just has to exist wearing this artifact and everybody on your team gets 16% CR pushes when enemies are defeated. How many times where it's like, oh, I almost won, but I got cut. And this artifact fixes that. So I don't know. I'm, I'm really leaning towards giving her a sachet, but we'll play it out and see how it goes. And that's uh, another thing too is... Uh, what do you have laying around she can spare? I can't take this off of Elena. I surely can't take this off of Flan. So Unseen Observer is kind of out for me unless I want to cripple two units that I use all the time in the way I play. And Glow Wings. Glow Wings I don't really have on anybody either. So legit just put it on Curious to make some Abyss Floors easier. <laughs> so yeah, Glow Wings or Sashes. That's what I'm running for right now until I change my mind five minutes later. There you go. Ha, 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 ha.